Good morning, it is Wednesday the 12th of April. I just filmed a skincare routine, so that will be on my um, channel at some point. Um, just having my morning cup of tea and then I'm about to go and get my hair cut. In my last vlog, I mentioned that I wanted to get back into vlogging and um, Wednesday is my day off and then I'm not gonna be off till Saturday or Sunday, but I thought anything that I get up to, interesting to show you that's just money going in the bathroom um then i will film like wednesday saturday sunday and put it together as a little vlog um so other than getting my hair cut the only thing that i've got planned today is walking macy and then me and james are going to go out for tea for a little date night which is very rare like we never go out for food or do anything together to be honest um our shifts are always like so different but we've both got the day off so that's the plan, just gonna take you along with me and see what I get up to. Um, and my hair's now extremely frizzy, so that's new. So, <laughs> um, it's a bit shorter than I expected. Um, I had a picture that I kind of went off but I also wanted all of the dead off because I had a lot of split ends like dead ends which mainly are from when I used to bleach my hair so I was basically trying to grow out where it was bleached obviously it's brown now but you could still tell because it was like lighter and very dead so it's a bit shorter than I imagined but um yeah I do quite like it I think it's obviously a lot easier the shorter it is like i'd love my hair to be like my sister's she's got really long nice shiny healthy hair but every time mine grows quite well it's time to get it cut um but i do remember a few years ago i had it probably about this length actually maybe a tiny bit shorter and it was blonde and it was just so easy like when i washed it like it dried so quick um and i looked after it really well with like loads of heat protection and like natural products so um yeah anyway i've got home i'm gonna do my makeup my mum's mentioned going out um shopping <laughs> so i might get a hair dye while i'm out um so that i can dye it dark brown again and also get some heat protection because i've run out so i actually don't have any so yeah that's the plan look at these two besties chilling on the bed i always think they're really embarrassed when i find them like sleeping next to each other hi girls Get you anything today? No, I didn't. Do you want to see? Are you watching me? Got some Kit Kats, some garlic bread, very exciting. Are you watching? Some heat protection spray for my hair. Do you approve? Yeah. What else? And then a hair dye. Mummy's gonna dye her hair. Yes. And then some cookies. And you can't have any of it. Shall I give you a treat instead? Would you like a treat? Do you want a treat? It. Pa. Good girl. There you go. Are you showing me your koala? Oh. oh dear. Oh dear. I'm squished. Have a cuddle. Have a cuddle. 
model. Oh, that's good. Oh, you just have to ruin it. <laughs> So it's now a Saturday and like I said I'm going to include Saturday and Sunday in this vlog as well as the few bits that I filmed on Wednesday. Um, I felt a bit rubbish Thursday and Friday. Um, I'm not going to go into it, it's not too dramatic but I didn't feel great mentally and I definitely feel like I need a self-care kind of weekend. And funnily enough, I just watched one of Louise Pentland's videos, which I think she called it Time For Me. Um, and she had like a day out in London and she was just doing things that day that she enjoys, just things that she likes to do. Um, and I always try and do things that I like to do, but sometimes I feel like I'm always overthinking everything, like that I should be doing this and I should be doing that or I should be doing this better. So... I'm really going to try this weekend to just do things that I enjoy and just try not overthink anything. Um, I got up this morning and I actually have managed to clean pretty much all of upstairs. Um, I'm going to do downstairs now so that it's out the way so that the rest of the weekend is just doing things that I want to do for me. James is at work for the whole weekend as well. So yeah, just kind of things that I like, my hobbies. I've got Christy coming around soon. Um, so that'll be nice to catch up with her and spend some time with her and then um, we'll probably have some food later. I definitely want to do some planning. I think I'm going to have a bath tomorrow. I'm also dyeing my hair tomorrow. Um, I just generally do the things that I like to do. That was a bit of a ramble I think um, but I'm just about to do my skincare and makeup and then I'm going to go downstairs, clean downstairs and then walk Macy before Christy comes around. Um, I won't go through my skincare and makeup today because I have actually filmed a separate skincare and makeup video that will be going on my channel so I won't talk you through it I'll just do like a time lapse um but yeah I'm just gonna get ready Miley's come to say hello. So we're just going to go through this box of beauty products because every now and again I go through it, have a little clear out drawer, and you mostly get the what the leftover bit. Yes, yeah, um, and then anything else, obviously, well, it either goes back or if it's not being used, I can like give it to charity or whatever. But. Um, yeah, so we're just going to go through it and Miley's obviously going to have a little browse as well, see if she's interested in anything. Could we interest you in this? No? Okay. She's gone. No, she's gone. Okay, so yeah, we're just going to go through this, going to put it in a time lapse um, and see what Christy wants. I know that she's ne definitely not going to want the lavender thing there, but I'll put it in there in hopes that somebody will have it because right, I don't know. like lavender. Right, we'll put it in a time lapse. This is the bag and now my office is going to just feel like so cleansed. Less, less I feel cluttered. like I've had a big declutter. So now, you know what I was saying about changing the 
um, storage situation mm -hmm. be a lot easier. Yeah. Because I'll have this less of stuff yeah. to transfer over. So, yeah. There we go. Thumbs up. Hi. Do you like Christy? Huh? Is that Thank your you new much. friend? Chocolate. The Grand National on his final ride. Harry Cobden followed him on Coco Beach. They're all being cheered. It looks like the race could have gone under Melling Road, and it is Mr. Coffee who leads the field back towards the Sands of Richard. So Mr. Coffee leads the field, but the source is well. I swear, I've got to think mine's at the back. So it's just about six o'clock now. Um, Christy's just left. We had a really nice afternoon. Um, obviously had a little catch up. Uh, we listened to some music, mainly One Direction. Uh, we had a pizza and um, watched the Grand National only because we had bets on. Um, and then we also went through my skincare and beauty because like I said, I have quite a lot of like duplicates um, and just products that I'm not going to get around to using because I've got so many things in my drawers. And um, so I had a bit of a clear out um, and she took some of those. So I'm now going to do some planning, which is aside from like beauty um, and content creating, planning is definitely my other main hobby. Um, so I stick a plan and it might obviously not be everyone's cup of tea. Um, it's very popular in America. I would say it is popular in the UK. Um, but obviously, if you are not into kind of like stationery and like journaling and stuff, then you may not have ever seen it. Um, but yes, yeah, so I stick a plan. So this is what the pages look like before. Um, I get weekly sticker kits from Planiface and I'm using um, foils from Lily Blossom Designs just to add a little sparkle. Um, I'm actually going to be planning the week of Mother's Day. So I'm using this afternoon tea kit because we did actually go for afternoon tea and for a spa day. So that's really cute. This is what it ends up looking like. Obviously, we've got um, each day of the week, um, I put kind of pretty much everything that I do um down in these so this was when I went to London so it is a little bit more exciting here but there is days where it is pretty chilled or if obviously I've been working um I work 10 hour shifts so normally I don't have a lot of time on an evening to do much um but that's kind of what it looks like here's like another example this is one of my favourite ones. Um, but yeah, so it's just basically like a scrapbook. Um, I call it memory planning because I go back and plan and put stickers down for what I've got up to. I don't kind of like plan the week ahead, if that makes sense. But yeah, so that's what I'm going to spend some time doing now. Um, and I'm going to make myself a cup of tea and put some YouTube on on my laptop as well. I'm just about to get ready for bed. Um, I don't think I've filmed much today, hopefully she, um, but I feel very good that I got all of the cleaning done and obviously had a nice afternoon. Um, and obviously now I'm gonna have an early night, get up tomorrow, I need to go food shopping, I'm gonna have a bath. Um, just gonna give her some attention before I go to bed. Macy's been upstairs for the first, well, not the first time because she's often ran upstairs, but she's been in our bedroom on the bed for the first time. Um, so tempted to let her sleep in the bed, but I'm not sure how the cats would feel because Ruby quite often jumps on us and lays on us. Don't you, baby? Huh? Someone's being a bit vocal tonight, aren't you? Is that nice? Girl. I'm gonna get you a treat. Do you want me to brush you? I'm gonna get you a brush. Miley's come to say good morning, haven't you? So I didn't actually vlog as much yesterday as I would have liked to, but that's because obviously when Christy came around, we just got carried away like chatting and stuff and just generally yeah, I didn't think to pick up my phone um, much to vlog. Um, but yeah, so I've just got up and it's actually half nine. I normally get up 
just when James goes to work, so just after seven. Um, so I'm a bit like, oh my God. <laughs> so I'm going to get dressed um, and then probably go and take Macy out, um, have a cup of tea, things like that. Um, today, I'm definitely going to go and get my hair dyed um, and dye my mum's. We're just doing box dyes. Um, I'm going like a darker brown. Um, I need to do the food shop. I want to have a bath. I'll just show you anything I get up to. I also still feel full of cold, like, I don't know if you can tell from my voice. Um, I'm thinking I've got a sinus infection, so I have got, like, some sinus tablets. How cute is she? That I might also put some eye masks on, like my Pixie eye gel masks. Oh, my God, this cat, honestly, look at her. She's not like this with anyone else. She only loves me. Don't you, baby? And she likes James, but she's a bit temperamental. <laughs> It is so bright in my office right now. Um, so I'm just getting ready. I've just got dressed, just washed my face. And um, obviously I didn't show you what skincare products I was using yesterday because I've done some routines that's gonna go on my channel. But this morning I've woke up and I've had a breakout and this one especially is quite painful. So I thought I would use some of the Mallow's Beauty Pineapple range. So Mallow's Beauty I've been using for a couple of years, absolutely love them. Um, when I first heard of them and started using their products, they were quite a small business. And now, I mean, I think they're still classed as a small business, but they are doing so well. They've got so many new products. They've like gone viral on TikTok. They've got like loads of followers and um, they're stocked in loads of new uh, businesses. So there's even a shop in town um, that sells like bath bombs and things. And they now sell their products, which I think is amazing because um, obviously I would always see their products just like on my phone. I would never see them until I'd ordered them or been sent them um, until like I received them. Um, so being able to go and pick them up in a shop, I just think is amazing. Um, so this range I was gifted and I absolutely love it. I don't use it every day. Um, I use it whenever I'm having a breakout because that's what it's for. Um, their pineapple mask had amazing reviews for people with acne and just, yeah, like breakouts. Um, so I've just used the cleanser and then I've used the toner. Um, I'm then going to use a little bit of this spot treatment gel because as I said, this bit is very painful. Um, so I would definitely recommend like their products are so nice and Miley is just looking at me like what are you doing because obviously I've just squirted something out and now she's scared um, but yeah I just absolutely love their products especially their bath products you know if you follow me on Instagram I love a bath um, but their skincare is really nice too so I've just put that on and then I do just put this on now actually because I'm going to put oh no I could actually yeah Oh, I'm getting mixed up so I think what I'll do is I'll put a little bit of this on but miss the eye area because I'm then going to put on some pixie eye patches and then once I take these off I will put some eye cream on and SPF but that'll obviously be a bit later like 15 minutes time or something once these have done their magic absolutely love those as well um so yeah I'm just going to put on a little bit of the moisturizer and you only need a tiny bit it's obviously like a gel creamy moisturizer so like look how much I've still got left and I just put a little bit on and my skin definitely thanks me for it. Also smells amazing because I'm a bit funny. Like I don't mind, I like scented skincare and I like unscented skincare. But some scents, like if it's like lavender or there's every now and again, there's like just a skincare product that I'm like, that doesn't smell nice. Um, Even like my Pixie, so I'm using the Pixie, what's it called? Uh, clarity range at the minute and that's also really good for spots but the cleanser I don't like the smell I mean I use it because it isn't really nice on my skin like I do really rate the cleanser but the smell I'm a bit like I don't like that so yeah my skin feels very nice and soft and I'm now going to pop on some patches these were also sent to me um pixie send me um like gifted packages every couple of months maybe and the presentation is always like just so good um and I was really happy when I received these because I've seen these kind of eye patches around I think I've got like a cat hair on me <coughs> standard of having pets to be honest uh, but yeah I've seen these like trending on Instagram and things like these kind of gel eye patches and 
yeah so i was pretty buzzing to receive some i've even got a cat hair on the little spoon that's just typical really so i'm just gonna put that one under my eye and i will look in the mirror and reposition it um but honestly they're just so cooling and soothing um i've got really dark under eyes and it just yeah it just makes me look a little bit more alive to be honest um so yeah i really like these as well i use these quite often because i feel like um oh god it's going to be hard for me to see now um if i was to wear a normal face mask or a sheet mask i often wouldn't be able to just walk around the house and do what i need to do because normally like the sheet masks are too big for my face and they're not the most comfortable so if i'm like sat down chilling or laid in the bath that's fine but with these i feel like i can just like walk around the house and like still get on with what i need to do um while it's obviously making me look a little bit more refreshed so as i said i'm just gonna go downstairs make myself a cup of tea let macy out give her a breakfast um once these come off i'll put some more skincare on and then macy does need to go out for a walk obviously i got pretty much all my housework done yesterday so i'm feeling like a new woman i feel like i can just do whatever i want to do i mean not whatever i want because i've hardly got any money left in the bank but <laughs> um but yeah i feel like a weight off my shoulders so yeah good vibes today um and obviously i will just show you whatever i got up to i might actually while having my cup of tea edit some videos because i've just uploaded a vlog which is 56 minutes long it took me ages to edit it because it was like an hour and a half footage that i had to clip down um and then to actually export it and upload it, it took me bloody ages so i know my other videos are that long uh, but i might get them done uh, just while i have my cup of tea i don't know if i've mentioned this is my new mirror in the well on my landing um my little outfit today this is a bit of the plant that the cats have pulled out so don't mind that um got a stain on my top just you know keeping it real here uh <laughs> what i've realized is because i got this for outfit pictures um and it is like the perfect length for me not for james <laughs> um but what i've realized is you can see everything else around me so like this that's on the banister because it's stained <laughs> um whatever's in my bathroom this mess down here in my office which is mainly like gift bags the pre mark bags full of stuff to go on recycling and some little bins and stuff but i've realized you can literally see everything so i feel like when i'm gonna do future outfit pictures and there's like james's stormtroopers and random stuff in the uh, spare room i'm gonna have to like close all the doors which will make it dark or just make sure it all looks tidy because like i said yesterday i did clean the house but there is still areas of the house which is technically clean it's just cluttered <laughs> so i still need to do that So, Macy's been out. I've just been writing a blog post. I'm now going to go to my mum and dad's and me and my mum are going to dye each other's hair. And then I think they're going to come back with me and help me sort the fence in the garden. I don't know if it was this vlog or the one before, but we've got a hole in the fence because we're extending the garden. But Macy keeps escaping. So, we need to sort it, like, with a temporary fence or something. What? Is this, like, a gravy thing or something? No, it's a cream jug. Oh. Okay. No, I don't like this. You haven't even tried it. It's not as strong as I thought, though. It's not as strong. Suppose. So, like this is how I deserve to be carried round. So I'm now back home and this is how my hair looks. It is a little bit dark, but it does fade. Um, and I do want it to be a bit longer, but I'm just glad that all of the dead is gone. Um, I've also still not got any makeup on. So um, I'm going to do my makeup now, have my leftover pizza from yesterday, and then me and my mum are going to go food shopping. Um, I think we also might try and get some screening for the garden because the fence they had, they thought would fit the gap of my fence, doesn't. 
so we're going to see if we can get some of that so yeah just gonna have something to eat and then go and um, also my sister and her boyfriend have gone to the gym i was gonna go and we we're gonna go swimming um but obviously i've had my hair like washed dried and straightened so i didn't want to get it wet and as much as i like going to the gym and i feel a lot better for going um i equally quite like knowing that i'm actually not going and i just get to chill all day so just been shopping my mom and dad are sorting the fence in the garden and i'm doing macy a treat tea towel so i'm just gonna lay these everywhere she's, she obviously can't wait and then roll it up is that your treat tea towel is it okay <laughs> oh man so i've just refilled the snack drawer so this is like chocolate so i've got little freddles these are like a fake milky ways just some normal chocolate in there and um, this is a little bit of dark chocolate i've got left and then sweets that we just literally never even ate um, the stuff in here is all stuff for james so things that i'm not really bothered about and i know that he's got two days off so he's probably just going to be snacking um so i've made his him his own little section <laughs> For while he's off um and then i've got myself these to work which i've left in the box because if they're in here he will eat them i have took two of these out because i work four days so i'm going to take one each day to work so i've took two out and put them in here for james and then there's four of these which i'm also going to take to work um these are obviously like slim and world bars now i'll show you some meals i got because i actually got some slim and world meals i used to be on some world years ago and I don't really obviously agree with diet culture and I'm trying to be a lot more kind of just positive and confident the way I am. But I did notice I have put more weight on um, and just like, I want to feel confident in myself, but equally I am a bit heavier than I want to be, especially because of my height, like I am small. So when I put weight on, like my body proportion just, it's just, yeah, it's not great. <laughs> <laughs> so i got those and then these are the meals that i got so i got cottage pie uh beef tagatelli um and then i got a paella which is paella with sausage so it's not like the seafood because i don't like seafood and then i got james the exact same ready meals but not slim world versions so yeah i just felt like getting them because i know that i like them i don't actually know if they are really that much healthier but because I could have them on Simon World and I genuinely did like the taste of them. I thought I might as well. What's she? Macy is licking the foot of my fridge. Um, honestly, this dog. Ignore the mess behind me. So the, is it cottage pie or shepherd's pie? Cottage pie is 69 calories or per 100 grams. Does it say how many grams it is? This is really confusing. Per 100 grams. What? Okay, 69 calories per 100 grams. And then the one that I got James, which was just like a normal version, is 111 calories per 100 grams. What was that again? Oh, yeah so i mean it is low in calories i don't calorie count and i don't really know anything about it but i just think if i can eat a little bit better so obviously i get ready meals for when i'm at work or when me and james are both at work because we do long days um and ready meals are usually quite high in calories So I just wrote this blog post, um, how I became a content creator and what I earn um, and just kind of going through like my journey, like why I started um, the kind of things that I first used to do. So this is literally um, what I would do when I first started my Instagram is kind of like uh, themed flat lays and um, there's some more there and then I started with some like bath pictures and then obviously eventually just started to post a whole mix of different content this is some of my more recent things um i've just made this little picture as well um just for like the set image this was one of my first ever uh, youtube videos which had over seven thousand views um and yeah so just thought i would kind of 
explain how I started, why I started, um, you know, kind of like what I earn, which, spoiler, isn't really anything. <laughs> um, apart from obviously if you consider gifted products, which for me, because it's a hobby, I am totally okay with that being my payment. Um, but yeah, so I just wanted to give you a little peek. Um, so that will be on my blog. Um, well, I'm going to post it today. So by the time you watch this, if you're interested in knowing a little bit more, it will be on there. So, so I, I keep like not recognizing myself with like short dark hair. Um, so I'm now going to walk to my mum and dad's. It's actually raining. So I'm going to put my coat on. I'm going to walk to my mum and dad's, have my Sunday dinner. Then I'm going to come back, have a bath and then have a chilled evening on the sofa watching love is blind because i'm certain there's at least one new episode i mean if there was more i'd be pretty buzzing but i'm sure there's at least one um and probably have some snacks so i don't know if you're able to hear me because i've got the bath running but I just put my hair up in a bun and I've had to put on a headband and you can't see it but a hair clip as well literally because my hair is now too short to put in a high bun I mean luckily I don't tend to wear my hair like that like I barely have it up but obviously for the bath <laughs> I want it out of the way um, especially with it obviously being like dyed and straightened today so I'm just running my bath you're probably not going to be able to see very well because of the steam um, but I'm using this, which is just from Aldi. It is the Lacura Vanilla Honey Bath. Um, this is a dupe to the Laura Mercier one, which I just never, ever would be able to get. Like, I mean, it is quite expensive, but also whenever I've seen it, it's been sold out. So I was honestly buzzing when I saw that. Um, and then this is what I always use on my skin it is the almond oil shower oil from Locketeen and I'm just going to put a tiny bit of that in just because that makes my skin so soft so I have a really nice natural dreamy bath um, I've got my Cosmo mag because I've not finished looking through the pages that I want to look through got a couple of candles on um, and I'm going to make a cup of tea as well so yeah just cozy vibes I'm going to go in the bath for a little bit Macy's been left unattended uh, downstairs I don't know how that's gonna go <laughs> um but yeah I'm just gonna relax for a bit do excuse obviously the bit of like that plant that I didn't even bother to pick up off the floor I've got both of the cats upstairs with me hi rubes this carpet honestly like it's embarrassing but it always gets so messy she can smell the bath stuff and um, it gets so messy because of the cats like ruby's hair and then the litter trays in the spare room so that I normally like wipe their paws all over this it's always a mess but hi darling hi <laughs> do you want me to stroke you hi miley hi oh, i just love them so much hi baby hi Oh girl. Okay, let's see. Oh, Macy's trying to lick my phone. We go on to Netflix. Also, I don't know if you can even see the time there, but it is completely wrong. Just in case <laughs> anyone wondered. I mean, this picture doesn't look great, does it? It's a bit loud. New episodes coming on Monday. Okay, so <gasps> that's tomorrow live event. Okay, so there is only one, but the fact that the live reunion is tomorrow means that this one hour twenty nine episode must have all of the weddings, so I can live with that. So, oh my god, this has gone so blurry. Oh, well, this will keep me going until James is home. What time is it actually? Okay, so it's 20 past nine. So this will finish at 20 to 11. So that's actually good. Oh, actually, no, it might be 10 to 11. That's good timing. Right, I'm going to pop that on and get some snacks. Okay, so I'm just going to have a Freddo and one of these 
for all Milky Ways. Because the only thing with having, having Sunday dinner is that because it's mostly vegetables, I feel like I get hungry on the evening. So I'm going to have those and some Pepsi Max. And this may or may not be the end of the video because on Wednesday, I need to book actually, on Wednesday I'm getting my nails done, which is a nice, you know, thing for me. Continuing with the theme, um, and James is at work. So depending on what my mum and grandma want to do, if they want to do anything, they usually do on a Wednesday, I might include some footage. So this may or may not be the end of the video. But I am so glad that James had just pulled up on the drive because there's a spider in the living room and it's huge. I'm still watching Love is Blind, but I've got the spider catching cup and I just hope he comes in really quick because I physically feel like I'm going to be sick. Okay, so it is now Wednesday and I've obviously decided to continue the vlog today. Um, the only plan I've got is to go and get my nails done at half 11. And other than that, I have no idea what I'm doing today. But I thought I'll include it anyway. Um, this morning, James went to work at half seven. And I was like, oh, I might have an extra hour. Because normally, I would get up when he goes to work. But I felt quite tired. So I put an alarm on for half eight. And I just couldn't sleep. Like, I've had sleep. I never know how to say this. Sleep paralysis. Sleep paralysis. Paralysis. Anyway, I've had that for years. I think it started when I was doing night shifts at home um, in lockdown a few years ago. Anyway, it's essentially where your brain is awake and your body is asleep. And it is the most scariest thing ever because I will obviously be conscious, like awake, like my brain's awake, but I can't move. Like, I can't even open my eyes. I can't move at all. And sometimes, that's just Marley jumping on the chair, sometimes it lasts a few minutes and it's only like once or twice, but I can literally go in and out of it for ages or they can even last longer. So now when it starts, I'm just like, no, that's it, I'm up. Um. So yeah, that was a fun start to my morning. But I'm to be honest, I'm quite glad that I did get up at that time because it's currently five past 11 and I have done pretty much all my housework. I've done some laundry, I've put clothes away, I've cleaned the house kind of like top to bottom, as in upstairs to downstairs, not as in like a deep clean, but clean enough. And like I have struggled for ages to get on top of the housework. Um, just with me and James both working full time, like it was just impossible. Um, because we work long shifts as well and I would just be too tired when I'd get home to do anything. Um, well, I was just exploring my desk. Um, so I'm really pleased because on Saturday, obviously, I cleaned the whole house and then I've managed this morning. Like, it's not even lunchtime yet and I've done it all. So that means that when I get back from my nail appointment, I mean, I'm assuming I'm coming home, but sometimes my mum decides to go out, so I don't know. Um... <laughs> so that means when I get home... I've literally got no housework to do like I can just sit and chill I mean I probably won't um I've got some stuff to do just like editing videos and I'm going to take some photos of um some products because I've been sent three PR packages this week so I'm very excited about that um but yeah I just don't have like the stress of thinking I need to get up and clean um which feels really good <laughs> can you see Miley um yeah, so as I said, just getting ready, going to go and get my nails done. Macy has been so sleepy this morning, like I'm almost concerned. I'm kind of enjoying it because obviously I've got my housework done and she has just been sleeping on the sofa. So I'm like, I'm hoping she's not ill, but I am thinking it could be because yesterday she went on three walks. She normally gets walked twice. She went on three walks and two of them were quite big ones as well um james went on a walk with her and his cousin and i believe his cousin came round so she would have been obviously buzzing because anytime she sees anyone other than me and james she's like mental um and then when i finished work me my mum and jess walked her on the nature reserve for about 35 minutes <laughs> in the background something and maybe she's just tired because she has done 
obviously a lot more exercise yesterday than normal so i haven't even took her for a walk yet i'm just gonna let her out go to get my nails done i might give her a whimsy like a chew um while i go out and then i'll walk her when i'm back because as i said she is just sound asleep on the sofa um anyway so my skincare is now done and i'm just gonna get ready but i thought i would just chat to you a little bit so as i said i don't have a clue what i'm doing for the rest of the day on saturday i'm going for some food with james um somewhere that i've been invited for like free food which i'm very excited about because that's the first time i've been invited for like a meal as like a gifted meal um i've been invited to a few events before but yeah quite excited about that this is my three pr packages that i've got did i get anything else no, I feel like this is it. I am waiting for another thing. Um, but the top one is some skincare. This one is a hairbrush. And this is also some skincare. So, yeah, later today, I'm hoping it's going to be brighter because it's a little bit dull and dark outside. Um, I'm going to get some content shot. So, some, like, Instagram pictures and TikTok videos and things of those. So, a change of plan. Um... My mum and grandma want to go to town after I've got my nails done. So I'm going to get my nails done. My mum is going to come back, take Macy for a walk, give her a chew while we're out to keep her occupied. I um, don't know how I feel about my hair today. But yeah, so I'm just going to go and get my nails done. So this is the before, which they are pretty much still intact, apart from a little bit of gel on there. Here's Miley, just let Macy out. These are my nails, nice and pastel themed. I kind of copied off a design that I got last summer, but I wanted like um, pastels for spring. We actually went for some food in town and it was so nice, obviously you'll have seen. I got a nice coffee, which believe it or not, I don't think I've ever had a nice coffee other than when Jess was making them when they were really popular in lockdown. Um, and we had like um, paninis, which were so nice. And then just had a little walk around town. Got James a hoodie with some vouchers I had. Didn't get anything for myself, who are me. Um, but yeah, so just got in. I've got obviously the content to take that I wanted to of the things that I got sent for free. Um, so while it's still nice and sunny outside, I'm going to get the content done and give Maisie her bone. And then I've obviously just got the rest of the day to chill. I might be going to the gym later. Um, so after the gym, I'll probably like wash my hair and stuff. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just going to have a chilled afternoon. I mean, to be honest, what time is it? It's half three. So I've got at least three hours to chill before possibly going to the gym. We've seen we got some cruise um what are these even called brochures um we went to Hayes travel just to have a little look my mum was actually looking at the cruises but as i've said i really want to go on a cruise after watching louise penton's videos so i'm also kind of flick through this tonight because i'm thinking um of maybe having a look for one for like 2025 so that i can like gradually pay it off just a little sneak peek this is some of the products i've been sent uh, from the job job company and what i've done for this company is i've done kind of like a instagram real tiktok video um and what i've done is i've shown all of the products and give little peeks of and um, kind of like what they look like on skin um this one is really cool because it's obviously going to be really hard for me to try and do this with the wrong hand two seconds but this is the eye serum and look at the applicator how cool i really like this because obviously with it having like a metal applicator that will just be really cool and soothing when you use that under your eyes especially on a morning but i've literally had to shut the blinds because there was people outside and macy was like literally barking at the window um <laughs> just had this on for her to watch and she was literally flat out so i don't know if it's because it's meant to be calming for them but she was full on flat out she's now running around the garden i am going to get ready to go to the gym in a minute 
I'm not gonna lie, I'm so tired. Like I know I won't regret going, but right now I could literally just sit on the foot sofa and do nothing. I feel like I've had a nice day. Like I'm really glad that I got everything done and obviously where we went for food, that was really nice. Um, I'm looking forward to Saturday. So I'm probably just gonna have a chilled evening. Oh, and I need to wash my hair tonight as well. So I don't know if to just get Jess to straighten it afterwards. But that means like coming home after the gym showering and then going around to my mum and dad's which is only around the corner to be fair but it just means like once i've been in the shower i'd quite like to get my pajamas on but i suppose now that it's this short i could definitely straighten it myself um it was just when it was longer i hated straightening it so we'll see or i might just let it dry naturally and see how we go um obviously it's a bit greasy at the minute um i'm at work thursday friday and then saturday oh my god i might work on saturday no, I can't be. No, I don't think I am. Um, on Saturday, obviously, I'm going out, so I do want my hair to look nice, and I might be going out Friday night. So I might just have natural hair at least tomorrow, and then I'll assess the situation. <laughs> So I've just had a shower. I haven't really completely dried my hair, but I'm just gonna make my tea because it is literally nearly nine o'clock. I honestly don't know where the day's gone. Um, I'm just gonna have a jacket potato because obviously, oh my God, I don't even think I've got anything to take to work for dinner. That's annoying. <laughs> Sidetracked. Uh, yeah, because obviously I had quite a big lunch. I'm just gonna have a jacket potato. Um, and some little chocolates tonight. Okay, so my hair is dried. Um, a little bit curlier than I imagined because I feel like when I got it cut, um, it was quite curly and then I felt like all the curly bits got cut off. Um, but yeah, I'm going to see how I feel about it in the morning. I might straighten it if I don't like it. Just watching Netflix. I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, thank you for watching. To this point, if you have, do leave me a comment and let me know. Because I feel like I've just rambled this entire vlog. Snuggle the pets, have some chocolate and watch Netflix. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Say bye, guys. She's camera shy.